Hi, today's Monday, so I wanna provide a coaching tip that you can leverage in your one-on-ones as a frontline sales manager with your sales professionals. And this is an element of digital selling best practices. This is an activity indicator you're going to wanna look for. So, bring in a sales professional into your one-on-one, specifically sellers that are account-based sales development or account-based sellers. Here's what I'd like you to do. The relationship between your CRM data and your social network, let's use LinkedIn as our proxy for now, should be a relationship of one to one. Why? Because your CRM is a holding place for phone numbers and email addresses and activity logs. But what it is not is a holding bin of relationships. Relationships are formed, of course, face to face and in person, but where do they begin? Many of them begin digitally online. And so if you're going to socially surround your customer, you need to form real authentic relationships with them and that can begin by connecting with them, sharing their insights, being part of their social network is the very basic elements of account-based sales development. So as a frontline sales manager, call a sales professional into your one-on-one and as a coach, ask them a simple question. May you please bring up the top account that you're working on right now. What you're doing is a spot check, you're doing an audit. What I'd like you to do, and I'm gonna give a real life example here, is I've pulled up a particular account, I'm going to pull up Market Source. Okay, so Market Source is a customer of ours, and you have John and Anne and the team over at Market Source. Great, incredible, incredible team there. So if I am an account based seller, and they are part of my account base. I pull up the CRM and I say, great, okay, do you have the uh, the obligatory five to seven champions, influencers, decision makers? I mean, this is truly the challenger customer here. Do you have the appropriate people in your CRM, whether you use Microsoft Dynamics or Salesforce, whatever CRM you use, is it logged in there? So did you take data from tools like LinkedIn and make sure that we have the right information in our CRM. That's step one. Step number two though, I want you to pull up LinkedIn. And the very same people that you have in LinkedIn or in your CRM, are you also connected to them socially? And so what you're looking for is that same spot on it. That's the one-one relationship that you wanna see. And the reason why you're gonna ask for top account, because if they're not doing this on the account that they've just submitted a proposal to, or they're in contract negotiations with, or this is their top account they're following for the year, do you think that they're honestly doing this for the other 25, 50, or 100 other named accounts that they're part of? That is the red flag you're looking for as a frontline sales manager. So I'll repeat the steps. What am I trying to do? I want a one-to-one relationship between CRM data and social relationships. Data and relationships are together. Number two, spot check top accounts. If they're not doing it on top accounts, they're absolutely just not doing it. So on top account spot check, pull me up who we have in our social uh, or in our CRM. And again, you're looking to, you're spot checking number one, are we the kind of organization that is only inputting one or two contacts? Right now, we're at risk in those accounts. We are not formulating enough relationships in our customer base or prospective customer base. And then number two, Pull up tools like LinkedIn as an example. Have you also been tagging these people, asking to connect, sharing insights with them, sharing enough value for them to connect with you, socially surrounding these particular accounts? That's the relationship that I want to see specifically. And if you're a if you're an enterprise seller, a strategic seller, big commercial accounts, this is mandatory. As you move down the rung towards uh, SMB, where higher volumes, maybe you're doing it for top accounts, but I want to see it for account-based sellers, that one-to-one relationship. I hope this helps.